Welcome back to my channel. So on this series, I thought we would go over making a 10 ounce bar. Can I make this bar cheaper than I bought it? I bought this for $310. Now I'm not sure if I can say where I bought it from yet because of the copyright laws and stuff like that. So we'll ask permission before we introduce who we bought it from. So what I would like to do is see if we can make silver bars cheaper than we bought them. So this is the silver plated stuff that I pick up from Goodwill. These typically run about 12 cents a piece and we're going to see how much silver we can extract off these. Most of these have been tested with Schwarzer solution and uh, you see like that little dot right there where it's stripped off the silver, um, it's silver plate. And I like to get this stuff here. This was $4. Uh, I, I try to buy them when they're high, half price off. So I believe that was really $2 and I paid full price for this one. That's a four, that's a three ninety nine. you know, four bucks. And this is another one that you picked up. So we're gonna see how much silver we can get off this to make that 10 ounce bar. There's a couple of these things that I picked up. They're from, they're from breakers, they're silver plated. Um, and what I'm trying to do is keep the cost to a minimum. So we're gonna be hitting up Goodwill. We're gonna be hitting up Estates. We're gonna stay away from eBay because you never get deals on eBay. In fact, you get kind of screwed on eBay. You'll find some pieces that aren't labeled. You really gotta ask for photos. You gotta ask for silver weight. You gotta watch buying on eBay. They're just, it's not a buyer's market, it's a seller's market. And there are people out there that will scam you. So what I'd like to do next is go over the Schwarzer solution and testing for the silver. So you put a little dab on just like that. I did it off camera. And then I take and see how that's, that's red, that's blood red. Nickel will be blue, all right? So let's back out. That's red. It just takes off just a little bit. But I like to go after pieces like this and when I go to look for them. Uh, state sales are a great place to pick these up. I picked up a set of, I don't know, it's like 50 for 20 bucks. So that's why you see so much in there. And like, a, I do like to go hit Goodwill up for this stuff. Uh, not to give away secrets, but you know, like if you're going to make a bar, let's make a bar. All right. So what our goal is, is to try and make that cheaper than $310. I need to look up the price. I feel like it might be a little bit more. So there may be a correction on that, but we're going to see if we can make this cheaper than we bought it. Okay. And so we're going to do a little silver stacking. I'm going to use sulfuric acid and a little bit of nitric to remove these. And the plates that I showed you earlier will be running through a water cell to recover that. All right, so uh, I'd like to just finish this off by this will be red and I will find a piece that has nickel on it and uh, we'll test it. But the solution basically is blue. This will be red for silver and blue will be of the color of nickel and you want to stay away from nickel.